this is my home for the week. So I thought that you'd like to have a look round. So we come straight into the kitchen. Mark and I first came to Peace and Plenty on Boss Grown Farm for our honeymoon. A little different. Welcome. This is my home for the week. It's called Peace and Plenty and it's somewhere that we come very often. It's in Cornwall. So I thought that you'd like to have a look round. Follow me. It's an upside down house. So to get in through the front door, we need to go up these stairs. We're going straight into the kitchen. So here we are in the kitchen. As you can see, we've made ourselves at home. We've got our bits and pieces out, so it's not looking quite as beautiful as it did when we first arrived, but it's still lovely. And Peace and Plenty for us is more than just a holiday cottage. It's definitely home from home. We feel so comfortable here and there's so many nice little touches that make us feel so welcome. Now I've spun the camera around, you can see that it's all open plan in this upside down living arrangement, which just gives us really great views and great light too. It's just wonderful. Mark and I first came to Peace and Plenty on Boss Grown Farm for our honeymoon 19 years ago and we brought Immy here when she was only a few weeks old and Rowan has been coming also since she was a baby so it's got some very special memories for us. Maybe that's why it just feels so special. Lots of things have changed over the years here at Peace and Plenty, but this piece of art has been here since the very first visit and I absolutely love it. I'd love this in Star Corner. I could just sit and look at it for hours. Let me see if the Scrabble's still up here. Mark and I played Scrabble all the time on our honeymoon. It was such good fun. Yes, there it is. <laughs> Let me take you back the other way. As you can see, it's so cosy and comfortable. Really nicely decorated too. There are so many doors and windows upstairs and it makes it so light and they all look out onto the gardens and have fantastic views. So pretty. One thing that I truly love are the fresh flowers. No matter what time of year you come, there are always freshly picked flowers from the garden. Let me show you out of the window. Look at that. That's an original Bolton and Paul revolving summer house. Isn't it pretty? It's never nice enough when we come in February to sit in it, but I know that guests do sit in it in the summer months and play Scrabble or read books. How nice. For me, it's just the little things and there are nice cups to drink out of. I, this is my favourite one this holiday. Ashton Pottery. We've got Villaroy and Bock plates. And this cupboard as well. Look at these, so sweet. And this cupboard as well has my favourite cup in to have green tea in the morning. So it's really well kitted out. Mark and I have seen these tiles before many times and we've actually been to see the lady locally that makes them. I can really envisage these above my range cooker back at Star Corner. Love those. And there's the matching table mats as well. So if you see that building just there, Elizabeth, who owns Boss and Farm, has a sewing workshop there and she makes the most beautiful curtains. So here in Peace and Plenty, we're really treated to beautiful soft furnishings. It's all so nice. And the fabrics are always just amazing. The cushions. beautiful curtains. Everywhere is just perfect. There's some more beautiful flowers from the garden. In the past, the farm has commercially grown Cornish daffodils and these old pictures show picking up the daffodils and packing them up to send to market. Such history.
every time I come, I like to see what's been done, what's new. This coffee table was new a couple of years ago. They've been doing lots of work on the garden too. And I cannot tell you how warm and cosy this log burner is when it's fired up. It's too hot today, we don't need it today. Come on, let's go downstairs. More beautiful flowers. Another door. There we go, so you can get your bearings. Let's start the downstairs tour in the master bathroom. It's very nicely done, very lovely bath to luxuriate in. I love all the little details that are in the house and look at these cute little test tube vases. I'll add a link in the description because I've ordered some of those. I think they're going to look great at Star Corner. Moving into the girls' bedroom. So to think that when we first started coming, Imi has been coming for 18 years. She was only a few weeks old when we first brought her here and Rowan ever since she was a baby too. And I've seen this bedroom change over the years, but I love it. That beautiful headboard. Moving on to the master bedroom. This bed is honestly the most comfortable bed you could ever sleep in. The cover and pillowcases are from the White Company. Oh, they're so comfortable. So in the morning, we open the windows, open the curtains and just sit in here, looking out the window, having our morning cup of tea. It is the nicest place, the most relaxing place you could ever wish to come to. It's just beautiful. Just off the bedroom, there's this lovely little ensuite. Fabulous shower. More great views out onto the garden. Roses. What more could you ask for? It's just wonderful. That was such a quick whiz around. There's probably not really much to see, but it is so comfortable, so beautiful. And it's just such a lovely place to be. And we've got so many happy family memories. I hope you enjoyed that quick whiz around peace and plenty at Boss Grow and Farm. I'll put the details in the description. Please do remember to subscribe if you're not already. Please feel free to buy me a coffee. I'll put the link in the description too. And I will see you next time. Bye for now. Gorgeous. Hello. <laughs>